Let's get to know Google Plus a little bit. The main part of the window is dedicated to your stream. This is kind of like your stream in Facebook where you have these cards that have information that people have posted. It also gives you some recommendations of people you may know. It takes a look at your Gmail and finds out who you've been uh, communicating with and recommends those people for you to add to your circle. So same process as before, hover and add them. In this case, I see two Diana Pratt's. Now, this is a case where people may have a personal G Google Plus account. They may also have a work Google Plus account. When I hover my mouse over their picture, I get a little card that's got their information. I know that Diana works at Singapore American School. If I look at the, her other card here, I can see that it says at sas.edu.sg. That means that it's a school domain account. So that's her work account. So that's the one that I want to add because she's one of my teachers. It will keep giving you suggestions as you go through. You can add those if you wish as, as you go. Up in the upper right hand corner is where you have your notifications. I've got two notifications. When you click on it, it will give you some information. More people that you may know. When people add you to their circles, it will show up. And in this case, there's a welcome message. I can also do a quick post right from here where I can post text and video, photos, link, events, that kind of thing. Across the top are your circles, so you can only show, you can filter the posts so that they only show the ones from your friends, your family. You can also change the stream layout. If you like a single column rather than the card layout, you can make that happen as well. In the stream, the posts from the people who you have in circles are shown. Google Plus puts some recommendations of things that they might think you'd be interested in under a section called What's Hot or Recommended. If you click on the little flame here, it'll take you to that page where you can change these settings. Click on the gear and I can untick this show posts in home stream because I don't really want to see them. Okay. Now the next time I refresh my page, all of those will be gone. The stream shows the posts from the people that are in my circles. Just like on Facebook has a like, on Google Plus we have plus ones. So here is an article that I really like. I can plus one that post. Here I have an article where 49 people have plus one it. I can also add a comment to start a conversation about a post if I wish. And there's more settings about muting the post if you want or removing them from circles. Over on the left hand side is the menu and it's tucked away until you mouse over the home link. This pops up in all the different places that you can go and you might want to start by editing your profile. When you go to your profile, you look. it takes you to your stream. I don't have any messages to display, but up at the top, if I click on About, it takes me to my actual profile page, and here's where I can edit my information, show as much or as little information as I would like. If you ever wonder what people see about you, you can change here to view your profile as a public person, and you can control the amount of information that people in the public see. When I edit this information, here's where I can say, I don't want anybody to see my information. You can change that. 